We're continuing to see new LogForge vulnerability attack methods, and organizations are struggling to keep up. At Redshield, we know that security tools such as WAFs, vulnerability scanners, SEAMs, don't automatically deliver effective security. And that's why at Redshield we use a service model, where we use a combination of people, process, and unique technology to do all of the work which is necessary to simply provide customers an outcome, which is being measurably secure against LogForge, and all other discovered vulnerabilities for that matter. So our team at Redshield have shielded all customers from log for shell exploits within 24 hours, and we continue to modify, test, and verify defenses for customers to ensure that they remain effectively protected. At the same time, we've kept a strong focus on ensuring our customers' expected traffic isn't affected by fine-tuning our configurations for any false positives. So this is a combination of understanding our customers' applications, understanding the vulnerabilities, and also continually measuring the shields which we put in front. So customers that are interested in protecting applications from the log for shell exploit should contact Redshield, request a perimeter survey, and you'll be provided with a list of applications which appear to be running Java, confirm the list of applications, and then we can simply roll out uh, shielding across all of those apps, and customers then just simply need to make DNS changes. And this can be done within a 24-hour period, uh, pending availability. Um, it 